Hello everybody, my name is Izzy and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about how to choose the right college. I'm going to give you a bunch of different tips and advice so you can make the right decision. So when choosing a college, in my opinion, it comes down to three major things and I'm going to talk about other factors later, but that is money, location, and major. If you can prioritize these three things and categorize them into what you think is most important, it's going to make your college decision easier. So what is most important to you? Do you want to be near home? Do you want to be far away from home? Do you need your exact major? And how much money do you want to spend? So first, I'm going to talk about money. Are your parents helping pay for it for you? Do you have enough saved up? What kind of loans can you get? Can you pay back those loans? What scholarships are you getting? Maybe academic, maybe athletic, who knows? But you have to take in how much the college costs really into consideration because some colleges are very expensive, some are very cheap, and they may be offering the same degree. Once you graduate from school, odds are your employer is not going to care which college you graduated from, whether it costs $50,000 a year or, you know, $15,000 a year. They're going to look at your degree and your accomplishments, and if you have, like, internships and stuff like that, they're not really going to care which college you graduated from, unless maybe it's Harvard or something like that. But odds are you should go for the cheaper option, in my opinion, unless, like I said, you're getting a scholarship. Second is location. Do you want to be near your home? Like maybe you can even live at home or do you want to move far away and live in a dorm? These are things you really have to take in consideration because you might not be able to come home for things like holidays or events. And like when I moved away and went to college, you know, six hours away in Chicago, I was never able to come home for weekends or events like that. If I was say an hour or so away, I could come home every weekend. So it's completely different. And you can also look for people that you can carpool with so you can come home on the weekends with them, make friends with them, see who lives in your hometown and is going to the same college as you. And you can carpool and make things a lot easier as well. And then third is major. What is the major that you want? That's probably one of the other biggest things. Obviously, you're not going to go to a school that doesn't have the degree you want. So a lot of colleges have really similar degrees, you know, like nursing, management, business, most colleges offer all those basic degrees like that, so it's a lot easier to choose. But once you actually do define which colleges you are thinking about, go more in depth. Look into the program and look at what specific classes you're going to be taking and see what interests you the most out of them. Some classes might not sound interesting to you at all, and there's a ton of them in the major. And at a different college, it's all the classes sound interesting and you want to take all them. And in that case, you would probably prefer the major at the college that has all the classes that you want compared to the one that doesn't. And never overlook community college, especially if you are undecided. That is the best decision you can make if you are undecided is to just go to community college and get gen eds out of the way. And then don't be afraid to change your mind too. You're never tied down to one college. And that's what I did. You know, I went to film school for a year and a half and now I'm back at community college doing a semester here to get my gen eds done. So it's different for everybody. It's never too late to change your mind. Never force yourself to stick with like a degree that you're not happy with no matter how far you are into it. And like I mentioned the trades earlier too, college isn't for everyone. Sometimes a degree in the trades might be and I think these are amazing options and they're also in really high demand. My boyfriend just graduated college in less than two years with a degree in the trades and now he has his dream job working for BMW and is really happy there. So what works for one person won't always work for another person and that's why there's so many different options out there. So take into consideration everything that there is for you to do. So now we're going to talk more about priorities and I have a list of some other things here that you might want to consider other than money, location, and major. So I'm just going to read them off. First of all, we have internships slash job opportunities in the area of where you are going. You're also going to want to consider the student body, your housing options, the campus or the class size, and then student clubs and organizations. So what you're going to want to do is go on to websites like niche.com and compare all the different colleges and you can go into the specifics like clubs and student body and housing and compare them all on there and they'll rank them, they'll give reviews from other students and I think that is super important to look at other reviews from students who are going there because they're going to tell you in-depth things that you're not going to read on the college website. You can maybe even ask them questions about things and they're just going to be a lot more in-depth and personal and even, you know, say the bad things about colleges that other websites might be afraid to post. So definitely go on there, read all the reviews, go and look at all those in-depth little details about the colleges and rankings that you might not see anywhere else. 
overall just do your research you can never do too much research on a school after all it is a huge decision so spend some time doing a lot of research and in the end you know everything will work out you will find a college and once you decide where you're going everything will start to fall into place so don't stress about it too much yes it is a big decision but if you do your research and spend some time on it everything will work out so I think that's all I have to say on this topic and if you have any questions or anything to say to me let me know in the comment section and I will get back to you and if you did enjoy this video, please consider subscribing to my channel because I have lots of other college-related videos and tips and advice. So I'll have that playlist linked below for you to check out as well. And thank you for watching.